Okay, so now let's start putting them together into the uh, thickness equation. So we have this equation that is called the, uh, um, right, so let's write this down again, d theta dx is equal to cf over 2 minus, I think, uh, 2 times theta over ue plus delta star over ue uh, due dx. Thank you. Okay, so first of all, cf is equal to t times, uh, okay, so cf is equal to t times nu, okay, 2, 2 nu divide by ue theta, right? Oh, sorry. Uh, 2 nu times cf divide by ue theta. Did I miss anything? Okay, that's right. Okay, and uh, uh, delta star is equal to h times theta. So let's put them in. So d theta dx is going to be equal to not not cf. This is t, right? Uh, two cancels, and I get new u e theta times t, and then. Uh, I think I messed it up. Theta should be. No, no, theta is right. Okay, so uh, minus. Kind of want to do the same transformation here. I want to divide everything by theta so that I get theta square. Uh, so so I get the h factor. So in fact, uh, this becomes. 2 plus h, so let me put everything outside. Uh, now ue has to be here, and uh, theta has to be here, right? And I have due dx. Okay. Oh, and also I want to remember how do I transform due dx because I have my definition of lambda. Mm. La, so this is lambda. Uh, due dx is equal to lambda times nu divided by theta squared, right? And due dx is equal to lambda times uh, I think theta. Sorry. So lambda. So nu over theta squared. Sorry nu over theta squared. Okay, uh, now plug that into here. Uh, I will just uh, erase things. So, so the theta squared is going to cancel with the theta. I get a 1 over theta here, and uh, I get a, a new lambda here, right? Did I make any mistakes? Okay, if no, then this is basically new ue theta t minus 2 plus h times lambda, uh, right? Okay, and uh, basically here, lambda is the input, right? Because I know due dx, I know theta, right? So I can calculate lambda being due dx times theta squared over new, given any theta as input, uh, theta and ue and x. So, and uh, I want to compute this whole quantity here. So let's figure out, let's just uh, in here, uh, just plot lambda and that combination. So I have, uh, uh, I have what, a t minus, minus 2 plus h list times lump, not, not, times lambda list, right? Uh, so that's that's the line. That's the uh, that's what I want to fit, right? And it's amazingly linear, right? <laughs> Almost like a, a constructed. Uh, so so this is a, this is I think what made the Threads really famous is basically he was able to derive an equation that is basically can be fit using a linear relationship.
So, so basically, this is a, this whole thing is a linear function of lambda. It's not, uh, it's not by design, but kind of by coincidence. So, so you we can always fit this by polyfit uh, lambda list, and polyfit is basically just a fitting polynomials. And here I just uh, fit a first order polynomial that's a linear, right? So I get uh, this, basically, uh, this thing should be t minus 2.65 lambda, right, 6, 5, plus uh, 2, 2, 5, right? So this is, uh, this is it.